Well, I charge the same at DMV. If you're preparing for a DMV vision test and wondering if all eye charts are the same, let's break it down to help you understand what to expect. When you go to the DMV for a vision test, the most common eye chart you'll encounter is the Snellen eye chart. This chart, developed by Herman Snellen in the 1860s, is a standard tool for measuring visual acuity. It features 11 rows of capital letters, with the top row having just one large letter, often an E, and the lower rows containing progressively smaller letters. At the DMV, you'll typically be asked to read the letters on this chart from a distance, usually 20 feet away, although some offices may use mirrors to simulate this distance if the room is smaller. The goal is to determine the smallest line of letters you can read, which helps assess your visual acuity. However, not all eye charts used at the DMV are Snellen charts. In some cases, a tumbling e-chart might be used. This chart is particularly useful for children who don't know the alphabet or for individuals who have difficulties recognizing or reading letters. The tumbling e-chart features the letter E rotated in different directions, and you'll be asked to indicate the direction of the E's fingers using your hand. Another type of chart, though less commonly used at the DMV, is the Jagger eye chart. This chart is primarily used to test near vision and consists of short blocks of text in various type sizes. While it's more often used in optometrist offices, it's not typically part of the standard DMV vision test. In terms of requirements, the DMV vision tests are generally straightforward and quick. You need to have a visual acuity of 2040 or better in one or both eyes to qualify for an unrestricted driver's license. This can be achieved with or without corrective lenses, but if you need glasses or contacts to meet this requirement, you'll receive a restricted license requiring you to wear them while driving. Some states may also requiring additional tests, such as a visual field test to check for peripheral vision loss or a color blindness test. These tests ensure that your overall vision meets the necessary standards for safe driving. So, to answer your question, not all eye charts used at the DMV are the same. While the Snellen eye chart is the most common, there are variations like the tumbling e chart that might be used in specific situations. Understanding these differences can help you feel more prepared and confident when taking your DMV vision test.